Hi traders, just going to take you through an example of how this futures indicator is working for the uh, S&P 500 as part of our key equity hedge strategy. Now this indicator is uh, predominantly used for the smaller accounts when you, you can see when there's fluctuations in, in the futures uh, profit and loss, it sort of it makes a, a fair amount of impact on, on the whole account which some traders don't like. So th this is an alternative that sort of chips away and takes profit along the way and it still hedges as well. So for the smaller account traders between 100,000 and 500,000, this video is pretty important that you should be watching. So I'll just take you through it now. So it, it's called the profit taker. Now it, it works on a momentum sort of method similar to the hedge line, but it does take profit rather than just constantly hedging uh, in it's probably my preferred indicator because of the fact that it does give you a more smooth equity line in your account so you know you do get those returns consist more consistently rather than the hedge line being chop 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 you know in and out of trades and then you get the big move and then it makes up all the ground you've lost so for some traders that's not it's just not mentally sort of viable for, for traders to go through that sort of stress so this is a good alternative. So I've changed over to the uh, the futures indicator for, for the current spread I'm in. Uh, just so you can see the difference in, in what it's going to return. So here we are here on the uh, 3rd of May. And we were currently in the hedge line. 3rd of May we were just heading up into a stop out for the, for the, the 60 minute. Which is what we do on the hedge line which is the constant and absolute hedge. So that's gone and stopped out and we've taken a small loss on that. So this is where I've made the change in, in that lead up to that long trade. So you can see here, this indicator is currently being uh, coded up to be auto traded with Daniel's Trading, which is our preferred broker. So we've got a couple of brokers that already do this, but you know, some are in the US, some are in Europe, and some are in Australia. So we're currently coding one up for Daniel's Trading, uh, which is predominantly where a majority of the accounts are. So soon you'll be able to have access to this to be able to just be traded automatically. So there are a few rules involved with it, but it's essentially you enter in. I'll make this bigger so you can see it. You enter in on the green cross, same with the hedge line. So we enter in on the green cross to go long, and you can see the stop. It's down here at four points below where we got in. So there's smaller stops as well. And when we get to 80% of the targets, so this is target one, this is target two, this is target three. So we're taking out of the five E-mini contracts that we trade with the $100,000 accounts, we're taking two of the E-minis off at target one and taking profit. Straight away that covers your trade. So then we're taking one contract off at target two and then we're trailing the remaining contracts after we hit target 2 to 2.5 points below this green directional here. So I'll give you an idea of how this trade went. So we enter in here. So we trigger in here at this on this candle. So our entry price is 11.9075 which we get in at. Now we're looking for either 80% of target 1. Now at 80% of target 1 we're moving our stop to break even. So when we get to 80%, which is about here, look, I could get the retracement lines there, but I know that it hasn't gone to 80%. So we get to target one over here. So then our stop comes up to break even. So we've taken two lots off at target one. So now we're looking for target two, which we're taking one lot off. That goes straight up to target two. We take another couple of points there. So now all we're doing is we're trailing this as our hedge, our hedge stays on as is two E-mini contracts after we've taken profit on the target one and two, is 2.5 points below the directional. So now we're just we're just sort of bumping this up as the market moves in, in the sort of upward direction. So out of that trade, that long trade, now I've changed that futures indicator over so it's a little bit different the way we record it. So we all all of the trades, all of the contracts entered in at one eleven ninety seventy five. We took two off at 375, uh, 11.9450, which were these two. Uh, both pulled in 3.75 points each. 
Now that's one e mini contract each there. So now target two was eight points from the entry. So we only took one one trade off there, and then we're trailing two. There, this is a live trail here up off the directional. So at the moment that trade's pulled in you know, 11.25. So and we've still got our two e-mini contracts trailing. So what what this indicator indicator does is take profit on the first three or first two at least, and then we're bringing our stop up to break even. So that way you're not getting as many losing trades, and you're chopping you're not chopping in and out of trades. Which mentally, even though the the hedge line indicator is profitable over the long term, you're going to see more of a smooth return on your on your futures indicator rather than it being chopped in and out, and then you get your big move, which some traders are having struggle are having a struggle with. So, you know, we're at 1.5 percent or whatever we're at the moment. So it's very early days still. And I'll be I'll be using this futures indicator on 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 the spreads going forward to give you an idea of how it works in the live situation. And once that's coded up in uh, with Daniel's trading and also with our other preferred brokers in Australia and Europe for the traders that are trading from there. Uh, you're welcome to use this indicator as part of the system at no charge. So please uh, contact admin at Key Equity Hedge if you're interested in using this indicator rather than the absolute hedge. Uh, the, the returns on this futures indicator are, are better than the uh, absolute hedge. It's just a bit more management. So I'll uh, keep updating you as we move forward. But that's today's update. And please get in contact with admin at Key Equity Hedge if you're interested in the indicator. Thank you.